Welcome back. Every week, our good health team talks with doctors and hospitals across Metro Detroit to find out what's going around. We have been trying to share some of the other illnesses besides COVID, but this week we're seeing a definite shift. Dr. Frank George here to explain what he's hearing about what's going around. Doc? Yeah, Kim and Devin, so all across Metro Detroit, doctors are seeing high numbers of COVID cases, mostly among the unvaccinated, though. In fact, one doctor called the situation crazy in his words. Others specifically said misinformation about the vaccines and the virus are frankly causing significant harm to their patients. Here's a breakdown of what's going around near you. In Wayne County, COVID tops the list in adults, but Children's Hospital is also seeing a number of COVID cases in kids. Dr. Kevin Daisy says most are not severely ill, but some are. They're also treating more flu, but fewer children with RSV. The Wayne County Minute Clinics report influenza is on the rise in their patients, along with upper respiratory infections and sore throats. Moving to Oakland County, Beaumont Dr. Jason Talbert reports lots and lots of COVID plus influenza. Clarkston Medical Group is also seeing high volumes of COVID and flu, while the CVS Minute Clinics report increasing flu cases, coughs and colds, and ear infections. West to Washtenaw County, where Michigan Medicine reports lots of COVID and an increase in children being seen for MISC. That's the post-COVID inflammatory syndrome. Flu is also on the rise. The health department says the outbreak in U of M students is slowing, but flu cases are now increasing throughout the rest of the county. Upper respiratory infections and RSV round out the list. Heading to Monroe County, ProMedica Monroe Regional Hospital says the biggest issue there is COVID. They're also treating a variety of respiratory illnesses, colds, sinus infections, and bronchitis, as are the doctors at ProMedica Monroe Family Medicine. Finally, in Macomb County, doctors at McLaren Macomb report high numbers of COVID cases, mostly in unvaccinated patients, with a, quote, shocking number of cases leading to serious illness. The Macomb County Minute Clinics also report COVID cases on the rise. Coughs and colds, strep throat, sore throats, and ear infections are being seen as well. So the bottom line here, doctors and hospitals all across our communities are sounding the alarm about the risk from COVID right now. And this is without a new variant circulating. So I strongly really encourage everyone to start taking more precautions, especially if you're not vaccinated. But even if you are, because there really is simply a lot of virus out there right now. Back Those to you. Very sobering snapshot of Metro Detroit. Exactly right. All right, Frank.